Hey guys, what's up? So this is part two of that really cool video I made about showing you guys how to install the CI holographic or hologram, whatever it is, uh, looking theme skin. Uh, and I felt like I didn't just go into much detail in my last video. So that's why I'm making part two so I can show you guys little cool things you can do to customize it even further. Uh, starting with right-clicking on the uh, let's 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 do this here for example I don't know what these things are like little spaceships okay so a vast who uses a vast I don't know the uh, antivirus uh, software I don't use it I use uh, security essentials uh, I, I mean I guess they're both good. that's beside the point though um, right-click it and if you want to change the name on these like I said right-click it edit skin and then right here where it says name three, you're going to change that to, I want it to say security because I use security essentials. And security sounds cool with this kind of theme anyway. So you're going to see that it didn't change yet. What you have to do is right click and rain meter, exit, and then open up rain meter again. And now you'll see that it changed. And, uh, let's do another another little customization okay so this DNA thing I don't know how it knows I don't know how it knows my name oh yeah that's right because it's linked to my computer name uh, um, 23 geez I wish I was 23 okay so you right click it and you click edit skin and here you can change hair color blue what what no hair no I'm just kidding I do have hair um, let me see brown <clears throat> excuse me so again you right click it exit reopen it and now it'll change these you could pretty much uh, change the name and change the path the way you do that is you right click edit skin again and here you can see where it says uh, path to name documents and then you just have to type in the code for the path uh, variables let me see if there's an easier way you could do that because that's that's a pain to do it really is um, all right so path to corresponds to computer path th or path to corresponds to documents path th three corresponds to Photoshop no path four corresponds to Photoshop path five corresponds to Firefox so here you can change the path name but if you want to change the uh, if you want to change where it opens to let me see I think you doing the variables the only way you're gonna be able to do this which is kind of a pain and it's a shame yeah the only way you're gonna be able to do that is by typing in like for example it says firefox.exe it's gonna automatically read that as and executable so technically uh, when you open Firefox you're hitting the executable uh, you know when you hit the icon you're hitting the executable uh, the a shortcut to the executable so just if you want if you want to change the program you just have to type in uh, the program name and then dot exe the way you can find out what the executable name is is just go to whatever program like say like Google Chrome for instance you right click on that and let me see here actually you have to actually search it and then right click on it and then go to open file location and you can see here that says chrome.exe that's where you're going to be typing in here if you want to change the uh, the path to opening to that uh, location Firefox is the path name so that's what's going to appear right here but when you click it this is what's appearing when you click it okay guys uh, let me see what else we can pretty much go over uh, I'm sorry I'm just winging this video you know you guys know already by now that I don't like I don't like planning for videos it never goes well I'm not really a planner I really don't know. Okay, the Galactic Standard Time. That just reads it right off your computer and has a little Google search bar. My favorite thing is got to be this DNA and this neutron over here. Those just look great. I love that. The weather, actually, you can 
edit skin for the weather <clears throat> and you can change the website where's <clears throat> you know what screw it I don't know <clears throat> well you guys get the whole point I mean you right click edit you gotta read you gotta do some reading yeah you gotta read and you gotta find out how to change paths and change names and change variables which is always a pain but if you really really want to customize it for your own uh, for your own interest that's what you're gonna have to be doing right clicking edit skin and doing exactly as I said okay guys so this video probably wasn't much help but like comment subscribe thank you guys peace out